Hey, the new boxes came in for Penny Pangolin. Let's go check it out. Oh, nice. Trust me with a sharp object. <laughs> All right, so first we have. Oh, nice. All right, Penny Pangolin and the missing ant cake. Look how colorful it is. Very glossy. Yeah, glossy. Very cool. Yeah, it looks good. Nice and sturdy. Pages feel nice. Yeah, exciting. Yeah. A lot of hard work right there in your hands. Yeah, this was like almost three years in the making, these first ones. Now, future ones will not take nearly as long, but like between we this hope. and the making of the Heroes of Time books, it just took a while. When you're doing all the initial finding of illustrator and editors. And all right, here we have Penny wants a pet. Okay, oh. now this one is may or may not be a user error on my part because, uh, and this is being corrected, but the first ones here are matte cover instead of gloss. Oh. So still actually feels really oh. nice, but the gloss ones are already on the way, so that, that won't be a big deal. Yes, still very nice. There's Mr. Weasley. Yeah. All right. All right. Penny wants a pet. All right. Yeah. Penny penguin in the rock soup. Very nice. Yeah. Yeah, they each went with a slightly different color scheme for the back cover. Yep. And here, I'll just so open it up. Title page. Copyright page. For Don Brooke, Holly, Ivy, and Jade. You gonna be reading this to them tonight? Yeah, you bet. <laughs> How does it feel? Pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, it feels awesome. I mean, you know, you go through so many steps, people don't even realize how many steps you go through just for a 32 page children's book. But there's just every little detail, every little, like the layout of the words and the color of, you know, somebody's shirt and an illustr illustration, just every little detail goes into it. And uh, we're really trying to make it just right. So. Really pleased with the way these turned out. So here we have the first paperbacks. All right, missing ant cake. Very nice. Yeah, it's a nice, yeah. Oops, sturdy, uh, perfect bound. Colors coming out nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Awesome. Very good. Exciting. All right. Next, we have Penny wants a pet. Woohoo! <laughs> And the back of each book shows the other two books that are available. Very nice. And this one there's something about cryptic facts in it as well. Yes, yes, the back has educational info. What is a pangolin? And critter facts. Hmm. 
has uh, partnered with us to provide educational content about several different animals that are featured in the book. So all of these different animals you see are hidden throughout the illustrations. So the kids can have, can have a fun time finding that. And learning more about the animals that they're reading about. Yes. Yeah, so we have some education in the back of the book and then a lot on the website too, pennypangolin.com. And last but not least, this has to be Penny Pangolin and the Rock Soup paper bag. Very good at it, very good. The carnival scene there. Came out really good, very vibrant. Yeah. That's why you just kill the eyes. Yeah. Yeah, this is exciting. And then we also have um, how you can help info in the back. Because pangolins are critically endangered species. Red pandas are endangered too, and that's also the red panda is featured in the. Uh, Penny wants a pet. Mm -hmm. well, there you have it. Loki. Yeah. Congratulations, Wayne. Yeah. It must awesome. feel like opening Christmas presents, doesn't it? Yeah. Yes, it is. <laughs> Christmas presents that took me three years to make. <laughs> awesome. Well, there you have it. It's Penny Pangolin. Pick it up at pennypangolin.com and hope you enjoy it. Thanks a lot. <laughs>